Hey Saints, I'm gonna make a part two of look about or the ministry that the Lord gave us. Um, let's turn to Luke chapter ten. That's um, when I believe the Lord gave it to us. You know, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. I'm gonna read the book of Luke, starting from chapter ten. It says, after these things, the Lord appointed other seventy also and send them two and two before his face into every city and place whether he himself would come therefore said he unto them the harvest is truly great but the laborers are few pray ye therefore the lord of the harvest that he would send forth laborers into his harvest go your ways behold i send you forth as lambs among wolves carry neither purse nor Grip nor choose nor salute, and no man by the way. And into whatsoever house ye enter, first say, Peace be unto this house. If the Son of Peace be there, your peace shall rest upon it. If not, shall turn you again. And in the same house, remain eating and drinking such thing as they give. For labor, for the labor is worthy of his hire. Go not from house to house, and into whatsoever city ye enter, and they receive you. Eat such things uh, uh, as said before you, and heal the sick that are therein, and may and say unto them, Kingdom, the kingdom of God is come nigh you. But into whatsoever city ye enter, and they receive you not. Go not your ways into the streets of the same way, even the, the very dust of your city, which cleaveth us, we do wipe off against you. Notwithstanding, be ye sure of this, that the kingdom of God is nigh unto you. But I say unto you, that it shall be more tolerable in that day for Sodom and Gomorrah, for Sodom than for that city, I'm sorry. And um, we're gonna continue. I say I will stop at verse twelve. Yeah, never mind. I'll stop there. I'll stop there. Um. So, the Lord gave us this ministry. Oh, it's for Alex. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna rebuke him. So. Oh no. Oh no. I'm gonna. <laughs> It was like, it was like, it was like, What's up, buddy? What's up, man? Hey, Saints, God bless you guys. This is uh, this is a member of, of Luke 10 One Ministries, right here. Hey, what's up, buddy? I'm I'm at the group right now. Nice. Who worships this guy? Who worships this guy? So yeah, there was a video where where Ed Citronelli sprayed something at that woman at a, at a certain part. Have you seen that one? Nah, bro. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not here to Ed talk. Ed Citronelli can answer the talk with this guy, man. Like he's too, he's a mess. This guy's gonna. Hey, Brian. How you doing, bro? Nothing much, man. We were looking at some stuff of uh, Ed Citronelli, right? He's wicked. That um, that Ed Citronelli needs to repent. Yeah, man. He's gonna ask for God one day. Yeah. No, I'm just like telling everybody what like the ministry is about. You know the ministry that uh, the Lord gave us. Sorry. What happened? I was telling um, no. No. Um, People have to stop. People have to stop following Ed Citronelli. Yeah, we'll talk about that in another video, buddy. But like, I was okay. telling people that the ministry that the Lord gave us. Who? Okay. Yes. Like, yeah, this is the Luke member 10. of Luke Ten One, guys. Um, the Lord. Laugh on me. <laughs> Austin would laugh about that. Yeah, he he's at work right now. I think. The pull up on me part. It's a funny meme. Yeah. It's good to be with the family, you know, the body of Christ. That's right, man. That's right. 
I think this Sunday is the Sunday where I'm going to have to... I might talk to Pastor Bernardo. This He's Sunday, in Colombia, bro. I think this is going to be the last Sunday that I'll be in La Senda Antigua because I think I'm to be with this group because it feels like I need to be in this group because um, they really want me to have a solid foundation. And I know, follow Christ. I know. That's right, man. Yeah, but this I Sunday mean... This Sunday might be the last Sunday I'll be in La Senda, Antigua. I mean, yeah, I mean, whatever. We're still friends. Yeah. Even if I'm in a different church, we're still friends. Yeah, I mean, like, you know, we got a Lord. ministry going already. Yes. Like, you know, it's not coming nice yet, though. Like, we just got to wait and see what the Lord tells us, you know what I mean? You and I have, like, almost the same gift, you know, like, discernment. But we just got to pray fast, ask the Lord to give us more so it could grow. And look at this. Look at this right here. Look at this. this, this what? It's like a camera. There's like this camera thing, which eventually, you know, some flash or something. Oh, no. Hold on. Mm. Oh, oh, no. oh, no. He's right here. Uh, Christian's right here. So, uh, we got, got Danny. Hello, Christian. Breaking bread. What happened? Nothing much, man. You know, just um, going live and explaining to people like what, well, like the small ministry that the Lord gave me and this brother, he gave it to us uh, almost like two months ago. I mean, him, something that, like God, he's the brother. Uh, God spoke through this brother that we know from Florida, the one I told you about, Austin. And uh, God spoke through him, and uh, like me and Brian have this online ministry going on. It's a thing with me and him. But maybe one day if Brian comes, he counts him. Maybe. Uh, yeah, bro. I see it's like, cause I, I feel like I have the same um, type of a uh, connection relationship with my brother Omar. It's like God puts people in your life where you you just really close to, you really connect with. You're yeah, really, definitely. It's easy for you guys to do ministry. It's easy for you guys to talk to each other. So I think that's what God yeah. and, and, and Alex have the relationship that bond. So definitely, bro. I think you guys, you know, are are meant to be serving the Lord together, on fire for the Lord. And yes, praise God, bro. Yes, yes, man, definitely. You know, wherever the Lord wants me, I have to be there, you know, wherever the Lord wants us. You know, like I was telling Alex, you know, there's certain things that are not for everybody. Like, I've been interested in prison ministry, so it's called to do prison. Not everybody. Right. That's something I had to go to him about it. Yeah. Right. And I was telling Brother Alex that the streets are good. Like, I mean, I, I witness or whatever, you know? That's right. All right, brother. Yeah. Close to Brian, bro. I'll talk to you later, man. God bless you. Better person. Later, bro. God bless you, Brian. God bless you, brother. Take care, bro. Bye, guys. Lord's brother, oh my Alex, he was there for a few minutes, but, but yes, he's part of the members, and um, well, we wouldn't call it the founders, it was like the Holy Spirit that gave it to us, you know, like, everything that we had, like I was saying, Brother Alex, it's run by God, it's not by me, but uh, yes, um, I mean, the Lord has gave me, like, certain stuff, such a responsibility to have to take care of, you know, one of them is discipleship. Sorry about that. Somebody called me. Like, I hate it when they do live stream. Somebody wants to call. You know, like, yes, annoys me sometimes, but anyway, whatever. Um, um, I forgot what I was about to say. Like, we're both called to, like, serve God together, you know, and, um, like, you know, we're very close friends. Me and this brother, you guys saw him already. You guys saw him already. Um, I'm so sorry about it. This verse keeps calling every week. You say, yeah. This brother right here, um, and I, like, we wouldn't call it, like, the founders, though, but, like, um, I believe we're called to, like, serve God together and, um, whatever the Lord, um, like, this brother said that he might accept my church, the church where I go to, like, I go to, I belong to Hebrew Ministries, but I don't know how long the Lord wants me there, like I told Brother Alex. If the Holy Spirit wants me to, um, um, 
if the Holy Spirit wants me to switch churches, then I'll definitely will. But at the moment, I'll stay stay at my local church. You know, I learned a lot from my pastors and stuff. So, um, I'm just ex doing a little bit of explanation about what my minist the ministry that the Lord gave us is about. You know. Um. Yeah. I'm just explaining and giving you guys a little bit of. I'm just giving you guys a little bit of details, you know, what the ministry is about. You know, um, yeah. I'm sorry that I get getting distracted. Just to, like, here, let me, let me, let me do a part three because I'm getting very distracted, guys. So, uh, may God bless you guys in the name of Jesus Christ.